Hi everyone, Jake here with The Real House DIY. Today we're going to talk about how do you mount an electrical box when you have continuous exterior insulation. So the way you used to do it, you have your sheathing, then you mount a wood block on that, and you cut a hole, and your electrical box sits inside that, flush with the block, your siding comes up to the block. But now, we have our sheathing, a continuous layer of exterior insulation. We don't want to go putting a million holes in that when we don't have to. So we're talking about how do you mount this, or a round box, whatever electrical box, on top of that, and then you just have a hole for a wire, maybe a couple screws. So you sell this thing called a pancake box. As you can tell, it's as thin as pancake. It comes with a nice cover too. Also comes with this plastic piece here, secures your wire. I'm going to install wood siding. It's going to be cut to go right up against this, then the light fixture goes on top. I was concerned about how sturdy this would be for hanging a light fixture with the foam in between. I ended up going with three, about three inch long bolts with washers and nuts on the opposite side. Two, with just two, is a little bit wobbly. Three, it's like really secure. Also where you have the wire come through, you add some caulking there. And I use silicone caulking along just the top edge. So this is a drainage plane for, for water runoff. So if you get any water on top here, it's going to go off the side. And any water that gets behind here can still come out from the bottom. So simple enough installation. Retain all the R value from your continuous exterior foam. If you like this video, please subscribe.